well, it's Christmas Day, and uh, <clears throat> I figured I might as well make a video. Uh, since I'm not working and since this fixer clown came tugging at my cape again. I uh, came to my channel today and uh, a little starved for attention, as usual. <clears throat> he makes a comment on my page wanting me to come to his pathetic channel and check his wallpaper. He had put Tasco's head on one of the images from his uh, gay porno collection, I guess. I don't. They had like a dominatrix type man's body and put Tasco's head on it. Um, so he's sharing his fantasies with all of us, but I'd actually rather that he keep that to himself. But, you know, I guess to each his own. <clears throat> but, um,. So I went over there and checked out the <clears throat> picture and, you know, impressive. So uh, then I noticed that there was this video that he had on his channel about capitalism. Uh, it was a capitalism slam, actually, or an attempt to slam capitalism. And I noticed Zam Zamato had uh, commented that it was a great video, five stars. I don't think Zam really watched the video, or, or I didn't, you know, or I missed something. <laughs> Basically what it was, was um, Fixer spliced together some images, some slow motion video from slowmo.com. Uh, I don't know where he got the images from. Clearly they're not his. <clears throat> but uh, he basically spliced it together put some music in the background and some misspelled words to go along with the uh, the images. Uh, if you're gonna slam capitalism, at least spell capitalism right. He tries to justify his spelling saying it looks better to him so he wasn't wrong. <laughs> it's like, <clears throat> I'm sure he justifies all of his failures in a similar manner, but I just wanted to kind of go and ask people, I mean, I, I'm, I'm really confused about this guy because if anybody pays any attention at all, they will see just how much of a hypocrite he is. He removed my comment. Uh, he blocked me from making comments. He doesn't allow anyone to make comments on his page. And it, so he calls me in this one of the comments that I have on my email here that He's since removed from that video that I'm brainwashed in a co-op with the government. Yet, it's Fixer that needs the government, not me. See, I worked for the military, which was part of the government. I haven't done that in f over five years now. I mean, I retired in 2003, which is, you know, half the time ago from when Fixer quit the army because he couldn't hack it which his video if anybody watched that video he made let me just t tell you something a private story there's always more than one side to that his little freaking story about how his all that crap that he told I will guarantee you that's like one tenth of the story he the bottom line is doesn't matter all that stuff he talked about the bottom line is fixer quit because he couldn't hack it that's the bottom line he quit. He can rationalize all he wants about why he quit, all the stories that he wants to tell. It looks just as stupid to me as him trying to justify him misspelling capitalism. So, <clears throat> so anyways, I'm co-op with the government, yet think about it. If anybody was around when I was making my uh, video about the minimum wage, how much of a hissy fit that Fixer freaking made about wages and laws, how the government needed more laws, in fact, to protect people. He wanted more government in our lives, more of the government, yet he calls me a guy that's a co-op with the government. Fixer needs the government to take care of him because he can't hack it on his own.
He wants more government, yet he calls me a tool of the government. How hypocritical can you get? I mean, this is not coming to any surprise to anyone that has paid attention to this dude at all. The other thing is, uh, as far as government goes, he's a narc, Fixer is. Fixer is a tattletale, a narc. He uses what he believes to be copyright law, which, you know, is another thing the government writes. He, tr he uses that as an excuse to flag videos that make fun of him, and he can't handle it on his own. He can't reply with comments or with video responses against things that are, ma you know, made towards him. He has to have, he has to go tell the teacher. He's a narc. I'm not the first one to point that out. I don't remember who that was. I think it was Italian Broad, which would make sense because she's on the ball. Fixer is a narc. He's a freaking, I can't handle it. I go tell the teacher. See, this is why it's confusing for me. He slams the military, something that he couldn't hang. Actually, it doesn't confuse me. It makes perfectly good sense. He can't, you see, and then this whole dominatrix thing, this whole, now I don't want to say anything about bad about gay people because I've had friends in my past that were gay. But I think that, and this is not being a smart ass, this is really being serious. I think that he looks at somebody like me, somebody like Tasco. We were both in the military. We we're both retired military. We lived the life of a man, manly men. I don't like to toot my own horn, but clearly, when you live in the desert, I slept with a freaking gun tied to my body for 199 days. Every day. I had to have that. I lived in the freaking sandbox, walking around. You go take a shower, you come back, you got sand freaking everywhere. Ugh, it's like freaking, give me some of that shit, man, you know? That's being a fucking man to me. That was my life. Well, some people, I mean, not everybody's cut out for that life. They're not. Not everybody is cut for that life. But not everybody has to freaking point to it and like, that's like being a, living a sheltered life. It's because Fixer has problems of his own, like justifying, I don't know what. He's not a, maybe he feels like these games that he plays on the computer where he's part of a war game and whatever else. That's his way of being a man. But you can try to point at my life and try to make it seem like I'm a sheep all you want, Fixer. I lived a man's life, dude. I don't need any freaking government to take care of me like you think you do. That's good law. Remember when you said that? Those are good laws. The government writes those laws, you freaking bonehead. Capitalism is man freaking making it on his own. I can sell and buy shit. I don't need somebody coming in and freaking playing with that stuff. You want to be a socialist? That's fine. Go find a country to freaking live in that's socialist then. And let the government take care of your ass. Because you're not a real man. You don't know how to hang. That's the way I see it, man. It seems pretty clear to me. I think you got some issues in your mind, sexually, this whole freaking, uh, you know, Tasco's head on the dominatrix, I think that's a little secret fantasy of yours. That's how I see it. You can't take criticism. You block like a wuss. Everybody's blocked. I can't even comment now because you can't handle me, dude. You make a comment on my page, it stays up because you know why? Anything you have to say, I could just do this. Because I'm a real fucking man.